Today I have a tutorial on how to blend two clips together by cross dissolving them. Like this. So, if you notice, I have two clips right here one and two. And then I have the music right here to make it a little bit more interesting. But so, looks. Looks okay like it is, but I want to add a cross dissolve. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to effects. I'm going to go over here to the transitions browser. And I'm going to go to dissolves, cross dissolve, and place it in. And bam. You already have a cross, cross dissolve there. So what I can do is I can actually extend the cross dissolve as in it lasts longer by dragging these two edges. See? Easy. And if I want to edit the clips inside, I control click the effect, then I pick show precision editor, zoom in a little bit, like maybe I want to bring this out a little bit. If I want to bring it in some, just a little bit, maybe bring this in, and you know, yeah, I want to bring this out just a little bit. Then I'll bring this out. Yeah, bring this in some. Maybe we want to shorten this a little bit. Close position editor. And, and if you notice right here, there's a few things like in and out that makes it not as in. It doesn't do much, but normally I keep it on in and out, as in they both ease in and out. Um, you can change the ease amount and a few other things, but I normally keep it on video as well. Uh, I'm going to show you a second way to do it as well. So, you take your clip, I'm going to separate the audio right there for a second. You take your clip, you put it over the other one. This is basically what the cross dissolve filter automatically does for you though. And then you take it. You control click and pick show video animation. And there's a bunch of things that you can do with this, but I'm going to only mess with the opacity right here. Bring it in and then take this bar right here, we'll drag it out, and just about there. Works just as good. You can also bring it out like that, edit it anytime. This is a very simple effect and there's several ways that you can do it. You can also go inside here and actually manually keyframe it. But those are the two easiest ways that I've found. So if you have any more tutorial quests that you'd like me to do, put it down in the comments and I'll do my best to do it. These two clips came from Target Practice from the Solstinator. Subscribe to my tutorial channel and the Solstinator's channel. And thank you for watching.